So, hello everybody, and today I'm super excited because we have, as you can see by the new Rex on the title screen, we are in the Mayhem update. Now, um, this update has been in the works for quite some time, and basically what they've done is they've added these new cosmetics that change the look of your dinosaur. And if I've got to be honest, I woke myself up at like 8 a.m. this morning because I was so excited for this update. Because th this is like the biggest update that Primal Carnage has pretty much ever had. So, um, as usual, I'll put the patch notes in the description. And um, th they made some balance changes as well. They buffed the spitters a lot. They buffed the tyrants. Um, they buffed Carno. I don't know. If you want to go more in depth with it, just go to the patch notes. But anyway, we're not here for that. We are here to go to the store because we have had some lovely mutations added. Okay, we get the Inflexus Nova Raptor, um, Ceratus Spino, and Casarius Oviraptor for free. So we should have those. Yeah, here we go. Okay, so basically what these do is they change the model. So default Oviraptor. And then the, uh, Cressarius Oviraptor, which I think is ba yeah, it's based off, like, a cassowary bird, so it looks pretty nice. And then there's, where's the skin for it? There should be a skin for it. Is it default? Hmm. I don't know. Nova Raptor. Let's see. It is the Inflexus. I don't see much of a difference. Oh, no, there is a difference. It's more visible on the, um... The not feathered one, it looks like. Because feathered looks very similar. Yeah, there's not too much of a difference there. And then the Spinosaurus. This is the Ceratus Spinosaurus. And you can see it has slightly more spikes. So the, these ones are nothing too crazy. But what I'm most excited for, I mean, you've already seen the thumbnail. Okay, so you know what? I'll, I'll just do a rundown of what we have here. I, I think this is the new generations T-Rex. Oh yeah, we can preview it. We can preview them. I forgot. They added that now. Um, yeah, this is the Varus Rex, which is by Mr. Troodon. It's, uh, the new generation's T-Rex. Um, I only know who did a couple of these, so I'm sorry if I can't shout you out. But, um, this Rex, I don't know what this one's called. Because they all have, you know, their own little in-game names. But, yeah, here's the preview for this guy. Um, this one is the Brutal Rex, and this is also, I think, by Mr. Troodon. And... As you can tell, it's based off the Vastatosaurus in King Kong, which is, uh, yeah, that guy on the menu. Um, this is a Utah Raptor modification, or mutation, for the Nova Raptor. And here's, like, a little Terra edit. Looks better than the normal one. Uh, Geosternbergia for Pteranodon. The Varus Acro, which I think it's... It looks pretty similar, but I think... It looks like its snout is, like more lean looking and its sail has like the spine it's a lot more like noticeable and then we have the carcarodontosaurus which is always a cool one so that's pretty awesome um we have the dorsalis acro or as i like to call it the fat crow <laughs> i thought this thing looked really weird at first but the more i look at it the more i really like it like wow this thing is cool and this one I am not too familiar with. It's the Sucus Spinosaurus, which you can tell it looks a, it looks a lot more crocodilian. Uh, we have the Brutal Spinosaurus, which is basically Jurassic Park three Spinosaurus. Uh, let's see, we've got the uh, yes, this is the one I'm really interested in, the uh, Lacus Spinosaurus, which is the new generations. And as you can see, it has the new tail fin. You know, we're definitely going to get this one, I can tell you that much. Yeah, they added uh, human backpack slots to humans. Anyway, let's keep moving on. Uh, we've got the Varus Carno, which is just an edited Carno model. This thing looks really cool, if I have to say. But personally, the Carno I like, and the Carno I'm definitely getting, is this one, the New Generations Carnotaurus. And as you can see, it's a lot more paleo-accurate and... I mean, I mean, look at it. How could you not like this thing? And then finally, this is where I'm having the most trouble deciding on which one to get, because there's two different aloe designs. We have the Fragilis and the Imperius. Now, they're both in aloe, obviously, but I don't know which one I like more. And as you can see, they're both for the acro. I mean, what else would they be for? I really like this one, but at the same time, this one's really cool, too. 
This one is by uh, Toa Metru, and this one's by uh, Shirakia. I think that's how you say their name. <laughs> Sorry if I mispronounced that. I, I can't pick between them. I don't know how. I mean, they're both the same price, so... Well, I know for a fact I am getting this Spinosaurus. Alright, there we go. We get the new generation Spino skin. And we got the mutation for it. Awesome. There we go. Got the Carno skin and the mutation. And now here's the hard part. I, I, I want to get Karka, but I think I'll save that for another video. I, I really don't know which aloe to get. I, I, I like them both. I, I can't I can't pick. Like, I've been debating over these ever since I, like, saw both of them. And it's just like, oh, God, I don't know which one to do. <laughs> I don't know. I'll come back to them later. Oh, yeah. Also, they added sprays, which I think are drops. So, uh, they give you the uh, Happy Carno spray for free. And, um, I think, yeah, I think they you get them as drops. I'm not sure how exactly you use them. I'm actually gonna go check controls, see if they're in there. Spray is P, okay. So anyway, let's equip our Carnotaurus. Oh my god. We could- whoa, it has... Two horns, okay. <laughs> That's... Weird. Yeah, I know why that is. That's because it's the, uh, Longhorn Carno, and it kinda bugs out. I don't wanna- I don't wanna take it off, cause I might not be able to put it back on. Uh, that one looks good with it on it. Um, does this work? It, 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 you can put it on, but yeah, you can see it has double horns. Let's look at the Spino. There it is, the new generation Spino with our lovely skin. The Atlantic Spino, because like, honestly, why wouldn't you use the Atlantic Spino? Let's see what it looks like with the- I, I'm not a fan of this skin. It's a little too chaotic for my tastes. I wonder, how, how does it look on the normal? It looks a little better on the normal. Yeah, I'm not a fan of that skin, but, uh... Oh, the Marlin looks nice. Iceberg, they, they, they all look spectacular, but I'm gonna have to stick with that skin. Obviously, you saw the thumbnail. Um, I don't know, I mean, you already know which aloe skin I picked, because you see it in the thumbnail. But I want to use it with this Acker skin right here, because, as you can tell, it's the one from Walking with Dinosaurs. Yeah, I don't know, hopefully they find a way to fix this. Yeah, the, all the other Longhorn Carnos have the same issue. I am going to use this skin, because this is a favorite of mine. Okay, yeah, th this, uh, okay, look, here's the difference. Th th this skin on this Carno, it look, it, I like it, it looks good, but on this mutation, it looks even better. So, I don't know, I think I'm gonna have to be using this one for a while. Ugh, but I, I think I'm gonna have to go with this one. I'm going to have to go with the Imperious Allosaurus. Because it just, it, it looks, it, it looks different. If that makes sense. Like, don't get me wrong, this one's amazing and I'm probably gonna get it eventually. Something's just telling me to get this one. So, that's what we're gonna go with. And there we go, we have the Imperious Allosaurus. Alright, and there he is, we have got Big Al in Primal Carnage. Oh my god, look at this. It looks so cool. Okay, anyway, I'm gonna stop screwing around. I've probably been here for like 10 minutes just gawking at this. So, I'm going to go on a free roam. So, whoa, there are not many servers up at all. What the heck? I mean, okay then. Maybe it's just because the servers haven't updated yet, because I'm on here, like, right as this is happening. Okay, what- I, I want to use the Carno first. Oh my god, it's so cool! I love it! Oh my- I love my scientifically accurate Carnos. It's so great. It looks so nice. I love this. Yo, everyone. <laughs> god damn it, this thing is cool. I- I, I love just the way it's, like... Like, the skinniness of it, it's just, it just screams accurate Carno, and I love it. It doesn't look like there's many animation bugs either, but I want to look at some of the, the, these other mutations. Oh yeah, here's, uh, this aloe. Oh, I missed. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> okay, apparently that didn't land. Oh, can you stop making me look bad on camera, you little dick? 
Oh yeah, they, they, they increase the healing rate for Karno as well. Alright, so here's the default that he comes with, and it, it, oh my god, it, it looks too good, I'm sorry, like, it's just great. Rip, <laughs> I get to kill humans accurately now. It, it just feels nice to use, too, just because it's something fresh and new, you know what I mean? So yeah, here it is as, a uh, Longhorn, and as you can see, the, uh, Longhorns are, again, they're, they're, it's like, they're like, floating in midair, and there's four horns, but you know, it's fine, who cares? I mean, I care, because uh, that's gonna bother the heck out of me. But anyway, let's check out another mutation. Oh, god damn it! there's a tyrant limit, isn't there? Oh, screw you all using your tyrants. Also, I want to address these mutations costing money. Um, I was kind of disappointed at first, not gonna lie, but I mean... I'm just glad that they gave us some mutations for free, and also the uh, the money that uh, the developers receive from people buying these mutations, it goes to the uh, skin creators as well. Really hope these people uh, don't have all the tyrant slots taken up. They do not, and here is our new generation Spino. And god, it's, it's just, it's, it's, I love it. Oh hey, it's Toa. Hey Toa, yeah, th this is the guy who made the, uh, the the aloe that I ended up buying. Speaking of, let's let the thumbnail live up to its name. All right, well here is the aloe, big owl. Oh my god, like I I know there'd been like people speculating like if aloe would ever be added as a subclass for Carno, but honestly I feel like this is better. Hey Toa, here's your aloe. <laughs> Well, here's everyone lined up. <laughs> so yeah, as I was saying before, all the proceeds of these uh, mutations, part of them go to the uh, skin creators. So if you want to support them and their awesome work with keeping this game alive, uh, yeah, well, there you go. Yeah, like here, if I use the uh, legendary Thorny Devil, it just, uh, it goes back to normal. But then, for this one, it, it's weird, it's like a half. Like, the actual model itself works, but the horns get all wacky. So I wonder if there's a way they could fix that. This skin's neat, but I feel like it's a little too dark for my liking. Ooh, the, the locomotive Carno looks amazing with this guy. Also, I haven't even tested out the sprays yet. I don't- they don't really do much other than just paint like a goofy little picture, but... Oh my god, the gang's all here. It's Nitro's- oh, he bought the other aloe. Yeah, the aloe looks so nice. Oh, here's the brutal Spino. Yeah, this is like Jurassic Park 3 Spino. Hello, pal. The albino spino is an especially cool skin. Look at that. Oh yeah, basically everyone is on dinosaurs just looking at all the new skins. Oh, here's our new gener- oh, it's the new generations with the brutal skin. <laughs> Pesky hot. <laughs> Thank you, Pain. Oh, Chan's here. What does he have? He has the new generations T-Rex. Hey, you stole my skin. I've never seen anyone else use this skin. Except for me. <laughs> Although everyone is just running around as tyrants. Jesus. Let's see what this looks like with the uh, Saw Scaled. Because the Saw Scaled is also a skin I like a lot. Yeah, not too bad. Even so, though, like, I'm sorry, but nothing beats the Salt Plains Acro. Hey! Stupid guy just netted me. <laughs> anyway, um, there's no mutations for the Spitters, but they did get buffed. 
So they changed the spitters in the sense that they have a lot less stamina drain now, and their stamina drain was already good to begin with. Um, their jump height is uh, the same, but the spit now is a much larger hitbox, especially on Dilo. And they're also much faster now. So they can actually, like, escape things and chase people. <laughs> Oh god, the lag. The lag is real. The lag is real. The lag is real. And I got netted anyway. Well, I'm not letting you kill me, buddy. <laughs> it seems like a lot of people have picked this aloe. I just felt like this one had more of a Walking with Dinosaurs vibe to it, to be honest. God, th th there are so, so many tyrants. This isn't so... God, the lag. So many new gen Spinos as well. Oh, hey, it's Gulpy. God, the gang is literally all here. Seems like not many people have, uh, Rex mutations. Oh, I got a kill of someone on my own team, apparently. Uh, boy, what? I- Okay, I'm gonna go with it. Also, uh, Pathfinder got nerfed a bit. Um, honest- It was nothing too major, it was honestly just a change for the better. Uh, the range is no longer, like, crazy good, like a sniper rifle. So I'm just gonna test this, how good it actually is. I mean, it still hits far, so I'm pretty sure the hitboxes are different, just because the mutations are like, you know, uh, they're different models, so. I believe the, if, like, I shoot the tail, no, it does hit? Okay. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> also, you know what I'm shocked by? I didn't see anyone with the Carcharodontosaurus mutation. The servers must not be updated yet. And all the servers up are free roam. I just want to play the game like an actual human being. <laughs> For those of you who don't know, people who only play free, ro free roam are, uh, heretics. Well, I think that's gonna have to wrap that up for this video. Uh, I want to edit this as soon as possible altogether. Also, I noticed I didn't see the Dorsalis acro at all. It was mainly just, um, Spinos. Like, the new gen, I mean, the brutal, you know, uh, new gen, all that, aloes, etc. So yeah, anyway, uh, I want to get this video as soon as possible. Hopefully this will be up within like a couple hours after I'm recording this. So uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. And uh, please, get on Primal Carnage. We need players. I mean, if this isn't a reason to get on and play this game, then I don't know what is. So um, until the next time, I will see you all later.